Yeah, hey everyone, Brian with you from the Game Company. We are playing some more Humankind, continuing here as the Teutons, which are just kind of getting their butts kicked by the Huns. Man, maybe we just surrender instead of losing all of our crap. But then I'm going to have to pay them. Yeah, I don't think I like it. All right, well, let's go next turn. Let's see what happens. I have a javelin near. Oh, yeah, we were going to go... I'm going to leave you there for a minute. Uh, but, yeah, we were going to go ahead and take this fight. Please. So. Do we need to build some battering rams? It's actually a good point. Or I could just assault right now. They only have three units of citizens. We're just going to go for it, man. Because I needed this war to be done. Uh, they don't even have walls now that I look at it. So, yeah. Probably okay here. Um, let's put you up in the front line. Archers need to go in the back. I think, I think, I think oh, let's put go. you just on the road. Okay. This is fine. We got a lot of units compared to them. So, feeling pretty okay about how this is going to go. Um, hmm. A little more awkward. Although, this is their unit. Can I get up here? No. So, I can toss at you. I'm trying to figure out my options here. If I do this, I'm pretty sure that takes up our whole turn. Is it worth it to get the javelin in there? Or would I much rather attack with the 29? Honestly, I think I'd rather attack with the 29. So I think let's come over here and let's toss. Because you're only attacking with the 23. The thing is, if we attacked with the javelin, we wouldn't take any damage. But we also wouldn't be doing as much damage to them. So that's where it's like, I think let's just hit. Let's just attack and kill. And I think you're just going to chill and defend. Because you're kind of in a bad spot. Wait, can I not? Yeah, no, that's fine. Um, Yeah, I'm just going to have you defend. I don't necessarily want to take this fight. There's no path to this destination. Seriously? Uh, Okay, well, that's fine. Um... I love how these guys are, like, not dying. <laughs> uh, there's no path to the destination. What what the freaking heck do you think this is? Alright, well, come this way, then. And I'm just gonna have you cross the river over here. And I can't move anything else, right? These guys all moved. Uh, spearmen. Might as well. Uh, yeah, then maybe that, maybe not. That might not have been worth it. So who still has to move? You, but apparently I can't move you anywhere, so just end around. We'll see what they do. So they actually have four units. Ow. Yeah, spearmen are gonna die. That's okay. The spearmen weren't particularly great for us anyways. So, let's get you up here. Once again, I think we just focus down. Because if I just kill you guys, we can do that. Although, maybe I should hit the guy on the hill. Eh. There's no path to this destination. What? I am so confused why my horsemen can't move through this. There's some really weird pathing issues for sure. I think once again I leave my chariot where he's at. We didn't move swordsmen. I'm on it. Yeah, I kind of want to go grab that. Okay, let's see what they do this turn. They only have two dudes left, so they shouldn't be able to do that much damage. I don't think they can kill him. We're going to be at low HP, but I don't think they can kill him. 
Yeah, that's what I thought would happen. Okay, so then, we need you to die. But I need you to die first. This is gonna go into next turn, isn't it? Ah, I think so, which is unfortunate. Can I run behind? Yes, I can. So you're... Wait, you didn't die? Oh my god. Freaking die, buddy. <laughs> it's like, come on, man. Uh, so uh, we attacked with all the javelins, right? Yep, all the javelins attack. So we're going to come down the hill and fight. Dude, they're getting so much defensive strength just from everything. We did do more damage to him than he did to us. How is there no freaking path? What the hell, dude, is with these pathway, man? I, I don't, honestly, I have no idea what's with the pathing in this. I think our round's over. And now it's next turn, which is unfortunate, but, because we're gonna take the city next turn. Okay, so, um, Avaris here, I need more units. Um, give me a swordsman here too. Please, pretty, pretty please. Did he take something else up here? No, not yet, but he does have units nearby that are actually kind of scary. Because, you know, these guys just basically, apparently just straight murder us. <laughs> like, I can't fight against you. Uh, can I get you inside the... No. I don't think... God dang it. So I take it you. You're at full HP. I don't think I can move after I attack. So I'm just gonna end round and hope they can't get to me, which isn't true. But I'm hoping because I'm behind walls, maybe, I don't know, I survive. Nope. Yeah, I don't think the walls had anything to do with it. Okay, well there goes eight more war support for this stupid war. And then they're attacking my city? They are currently attacking my city. And they're currently besieging us. Which seems really weird. They should not be able to take my capital. No. No. Based on what the uh, advantage I had over there. There's no way they should be able to take my capital. Okay, so point is, let's just murder you. Take this city, and we're gonna go back and freaking kill everything they've ever known and love. Cause I'm tired of these guys. Um, Not gonna happen. What the actual heck game? All right, cross the river. I, I literally can't do anything here. What the freaking heck is with this movement? No. Oh my god, I can't. Go! Like I don't understand what's with this movement here. I can't like attack half of what I'm trying to do. Ugh! And I have to use my unit that's pretty friggin' hurt, which is just kind of annoying. Okay. So, what the hell just happened? It was just captured by the Aztecs. How the hell did they just ninja it from me? Okay, this game's starting to get a little weird. How the hell did they just ninja it from me? Someone please explain that one to me. I was literally standing right here. How does that happen? Hmm? And I can't attack at all. And now I have to fight their citizens? What? How does this make any sense? 
So I conquered the city, but I didn't move into it. And so then it immediately, because they had a unit, they just moved and took it and then just gifted it right back to them. That's what apparently just happened. How the fudge? That is... That is some... BS if I have ever seen some, if I do say so myself. I can't win this fight because um they got the they'll do more damage to me. Dude, that that's that's annoying. Because now I have to kill two more units that we didn't have to kill. Like, words cannot describe how frustrating that is. And we have to, like, call in these other guys, which is also just freaking annoying. Well, the did you really just spawn him in the wrong spot? You did. Yeah, you did. Of course you did. Can I move you back one? Okay. Which is which? This is the one that has, I think, all the bonus support. So I should be able to go here and then do this. Okay, so they only spawned with one unit, it looks like. So not as freaking annoying as it could have been. I, I can't move through zone of control. Okay, I'm, I think I'm starting to understand what's happening here. Go this way. They're just so freaking defensive, man. It's like, what the actual heck? And there's no path. <laughs> oh my God, man. Ah! Oh, they do have a second unit. Oh, all right. Well then. F my life, that's for sure. All right, let's put you here. Let's kill you, please. Thank you. I, I can't move you. I can put you here. I can put... You, you will now move through. Huh. Let's get you behind the walls. Not that I think... I don't know if it's going to do anything. We're going to put you here. Okay. Can I now attack... Oh my god, I can actually move him. <laughs> I can actually get help. And then both of these are our hurt swordsmen, so we're just going to leave them. Oh. You don't get the option to spawn if you move all your units first. Um, yeah, that's that's kind of an interesting note. Yeah, not that big of a deal right now, but that could be a big deal here in the future. And I should win the battle because I'm on the city now. If we don't kill, which we're going to kill. So, okay. Is this actually mine now? Thank you, or are you just gonna go steal it again and ninja it from me? Like, what the actual heck? Like, the fact that I couldn't even fight for it, that's the thing that's kind of BS. Like, somehow, they attacked me up here, and then this crab joined in, but my units won't join in to defend my city. Um, all right. Yeah, this seems totally fine. All right, anyways. I'm gonna stop complaining right now. The combat in this game, they're good. Or at least they're cheesy. I, I'm not entirely sure yet. Um, I don't have the money to rush anything. We're just going to have to build units everywhere. Oh, by the way, we can hit the next era. Do we want to transcend? Because, like, this is what's so effing weird about this. We hadn't even used the two. We can't even get close to the Teutonic Knight yet. Like, I can't use any of these units. So then maybe that is an opportunity for us just to stay what we are. 
do Janissaries would be nice. Poland, Spanish. The Edo Japanese I've used in the past, I liked. That's the only one I've used, but yeah, maybe I just um transcend. I think I'm just gonna transcend. And should give us a little bit more bonus. Yes, greetings. They're at 39 war support. I don't like how you can't end the war until they're out of war support. I feel like a mutually beneficial ending should at some point be acceptable. I guess. I, I don't know. It's it's a strange one for us. Uh, Nubians, I'm not sure what. Can I get you to come join? Are we in an alliance? Oh, we are in an alliance. Hey. Oh, they're a vassal. Uh, of who? They're a vassal now of we end the day, friends? Babylon. Interesting. I would like for you to join my war. Just, you know, throwing that out there. Okay. Okay. I got them in that war. That's what I wanted. I needed some help here. So, um, I demanded he joined the war. Everything's great now. Uh, we're in a much better position. So, what do I want to do with these two units? Can I kill you with these two units? The problem is, if he gets the attack off, which is very likely, because, you know, for whatever reason, these units can move like 6,000 turns, we're going to find ourselves in a bad situation. Um, give me a horseman. And we're going to end turn, and we're going to get a cut to the first time. You guys haven't seen this one yet. I have one time. Astronomy. This was basically as far as I could get when I was playing with the last one. But discoveries are not made solely by traders and adventurers. Those who explore with ships and caravans would go in circles without those... Yeah, actually, because this was the last era before. Because this is the industrial era now, right? No, 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 it's, the, what, it's a weird name. But anyways, the next era is the last one. So I think we're on the second to last era. <laughs> um... Okay, not sure what happened. Not sure what's going on there. Let's just let's just let's just skip ahead. I'm close to a war victory. I'm assuming that's yes. Okay, thank God. And then he's close to war victory there. They're still besieging us. He's not building one for four turns, so I'm totally okay just chilling for a little bit. You ran out. Can I get my dudes together and go kill you? No, but I can. Okay, this should be all three of my units. Yeah, he came to go chase these guys. Um, okay, I was like, you're not gonna run away? I'm kind of weirded out by that one. Alrighty then. So, the once again, that should have given us war support. Now we're pushing it back. Now we're pushing it back. Okay. 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 Uh, mutiny here. Um. I'm gonna take you, send you over there. Here's what's interesting. Yes, sir. If I go here. What? Oh, I saw him selected. I think that's actually bringing in this army as well. I think so. Okay. So we went up by five again. What if he comes and attacks Durr? Uh, well, you know. <laughs> We're hopefully going to be able to get around and fight him back. Uh, you have a single horseman. I was going to bring you up here. Because I want you to join this army. And actually, yeah, let's do it this way. Okay. Yeah. This got really awkward there, but we are, we're starting to make this work now. Good. Good. And remember, we actually have, what, Babylon with us now as well, too. So... Hopefully he does some F work. I mean, he's got like a unit right here. 
and so we'll see what happens um so he should also now be at war with us too right yes And apparently they're at war with Mayans? Yes, it is good to see you. Come take a No, they they don't know them. That's it. Okay. They're at war with both these guys. It, now what's weird is you s Oh, oh, oh. Peace. You're at war with them. Okay. I got confused there because of the multiple. <laughs> and I was looking up like I just I wasn't reading it right. Yeah, okay. That makes sense. Never mind. I understand. Okay. We got to keep popping out units, though. I don't know what our population is. I can't worry about that. We're going to have to worry about that in a couple turns whenever we win the game. And by win the game, we win the war. Um, and we keep our freaking vassalage. How dare you, Hunnic Horde, try breaking yourself free? San Lorenzo fall, fell one pop. That's fine. Close to a war victory. Um, they're How at seven. Do? They're going to die. They have nothing they can do to stop it. Trader out blocked. Trader out blocked. If we look... So I think they're at zero next turn. So I should win next turn. And we're going to take the two towns. Go from there with our life. Then if we went here... They're at 89. I'm back up to 29. This is an awkward position. Yeah. This is not a good particularly... We just don't have a good spot to spawn here. And remember, they're ranged. We're not. So we might just want to chill then. Sorry, we can't do that. I think the answer is yes. We're just going to chill for a turn. We're going to come chase you down. He's got one popping out in three turns. I just worry about going to war because I'm so afraid that like, uh, hi, um, we're, you're going to die now. Like, cause somehow we're not including the two freaking full stacks of army over here that, you know, just are randomly going to freaking appear. Um, anyways, let's come chase you. Now, see, because what they can do with their Hunted Cord is they can literally just attack one at a time. Yeah, this is not a good... It's not good fighting them in a pass because they could literally come here, shoot, run away, come, shoot, run away, come, shoot, run away, come, shoot, run away. It would just, like, absolutely destroy us. We need to fight them in a more open terrain. I think we do this because what we can do now is we can attack you that way and this way at the same time and absolutely destroy you good do we need more units over here i think we're actually fine in akin for the time being let's go ahead and grab uh industry get us some extra production popping out you're down to two turns there that's nice we have extra iron as well yeah we never ended up grabbing this iron because we got interrupted as for text what did we just finish we did the games, which, yeah. Oh, we need siege tactics, man. And we need to get some, you know what? I don't have any science running right now. I don't have science running because San Lorenzo, I don't think has given us any science, which, yeah, that's fine. Our religion's still spreading, right? Looks like it. Um, You know what we also never did? I have new wonders available. <laughs> yeah Machu Picchu 50% of the food from uh, the city to all cities interesting Saint Basil Saint Basil uh, 1 faith 20 faith 40 stability 100 score Taj Mahal 20 stability 50% money and calm city I have no idea what that means um, the Topakapi Palace by the way one era is this yeah early modern era so there's one more era after this um 100% production towards any shared project or cultural wonder. Interesting. I don't think I really care about any of those. Um, or the Todaiji. 20 turns before being converted. I don't think I like that either. I feel like, is that actually how you say it? The Todaiji? It'd be Japanese. 
And if there's one foreign language that I might be able to pronounce proper words, it would be that one. And I don't know if I like any of these. Like, I mean, they're all fine, but none of them are like, oh my God. Probably should grab Saint Basil. Saint Basil. Yeah, just to give us the extra faith boost. We'll go ahead and claim it. Then if we look at our cities, we do it in Avaris. We'd want to put it somewhere else for the stability boost, because we already have stupid amounts of stability up here. So, yeah, probably, but I, we have other things we got to build first. All right, what time is it? Um, dang it. Hold up. So I think next episode is going to be the last episode. I think we'll do one more turn here. I think next episode's going to have to be the last episode just because I am going to have to leave here to go to dinner. All right. That actually seems like a really good position for them to have moved. And by really good position, really bad position for them. <laughs> so if I attack you right now, I have all of us coming in here. I think he's going to run away. Yeah, that's what I thought. Now, can I chase him down or did that count as that counted as two of my movements? Okay. This is a way better spot for us to fight. OK, we'll move you over here. I'm leaving you over here still because I want the war support. Uh, we should be done with this war. So I want both of these, please. And you're going to become my vassal. Do I really want another vassal? They're demanding that I pay them 1200 Cannot be done as all the winning side's original demands may be added as surrender terms before any additional surrender terms can be considered part of the truce. I'm, I'm a little confused here. Yeah, I'm a little confused here. I think these are the ones. Uh, yeah, okay, there it is. Totally mon. And I don't like they have different names, which is really weird. Because it's like, wait, this is done. Whatever. Not totally mon. So how do you even see what they're freaking called, man? Is it through here? What about faith? Yeah, it's not they're they're called something different. Tolimon, okay. Hold up. If I do it this way and then look here, Sadlasu. And so they're giving it to me is my assumption, right? Oh, but since, and then eight selected terms. I'm really confused by this. I am going to save really quick. And I'm pretty sure this is working the exact way I think it is. It's just, this is, this is extraordinarily confusing. Okay, we got another five against the Babylons. And by, wait, not the Babylons, the Aztecs. I'm still mad they took the Aztecs from me. So. I can't take both of these? Oh, I only had a hundred and... Okay, so I have a total of 198. But I'm giving 60 away. How am I giving 60 away? I have six selected terms. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, 
Oh, okay, I see what's happening. So, we have to add these. Because those were their demands. Um, that's kind of BS, though. Because that means I can't take any, I can only take one territory. All right, well, in that case, just become my va I can't even force them to become a vassal. Because I only have 138. Weird. We're going to wait one turn and see if that changes at all. You won at the battle. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think they're forcing me to do this. I think I have to do this. So this is stupid. I literally can't do anything in this battle. I mean, I can take one city and gain 1,100 gold. Which, don't get me wrong, 1,100 gold is going to last the rush out some units. So it's not the end of the world. Um, which city would we rather have? 0, 06, this is 205, that's 34. I mean, this one's gonna be not hard to take back, other than the fact that it's extraordinarily defensive. Um, I kind of wish I could see these cities a little bit better, just, you know, for the record. Uh, 15, 8, marble. Yeah. This one has a copper and gold. Ooh, I don't have gold yet. Yeah, okay. I think let's take the, the pata instead. I'm still kind of annoyed by this. There might be a way to force in turns, but that's fine. And then this is the lower one, right? Yeah. You're gonna give me 1100 in reparations as well. Have my gratitude. Nubians now feel a little different about me. Friend. Now that I really Welcome. care, you're jealous. Okay. I mean, I think that was their city originally, so... <laughs> you know. And now I'm over the city cap, which means what again? Oh, yeah, we're losing influence per turn. Oh, no. What are we going to ever do? <laughs> losing 6,000 influence per turn. Oh, God. Um, I need people to grow. Yes. And, yeah, we're just going to rush out that. Just because I want to get some growth going. And we'll probably go for then support. Oh, yeah, we actually had walls over here, which is kind of nice. Yeah, all the more reason to grab that. Um, So we'll go stability here. And you're just going to slowly grow, and that's going to be great. Okay, so... Pop out more units? Yeah, I think why not. Give me another unit. We're going to rush out another unit. Um... Can I buy a third one? Okay. We're doing that so we can send them over there to help out. I might... Uh, I might actually ditch you and leave you somewhere else. So I can get the boot bonus speed from these guys. Because they're a little quicker. Might even do that again next turn. But we'll see. Okay, then... Sure, we can trade luxury resources. That's fine. Because I can make some money back from this. Um, enjoying making all this money, though. This is fun. This is fine. We also now have gold, too, by the way. Which is giving us money and stability. Good, 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 good. Uh, Avaris... We do need another stone ring. And I'm going to go ahead and build it. Yeah. And we're probably going to end up having to build it with everyone else. Oh, hey. Niter. It's not actually called Niter. It's called whatever the, that word is, but that's fine. Um, I don't know what happened to this other army, but we'll see. Okay. Okay. Then you're up there. In turn. Keep an eye on. Akin grew a pop. They're still besieging over there. You're coming down there, which just seems like not a good idea. I think he's actually going to join in on this fight. I don't... Can I actually even get to you? Yeah, it looks like I can. Is it my turn? Attack! 
So he's gonna run away. Uh, no, he's gonna fight. Oh, all right. Interesting. Um, this is not a good position for him because I can spawn in units and he can't really get around to me. Yeah, this this is not good for him. Uh, I need a javelin here, please. I'm on it. Come on! We're gonna go kill this guy first. Good. Then give me a horse. I'm gonna run you over here, and I'm gonna run you over here. This is only 11 damage. And this actually gives us his zone. And I'm gonna spawn another swordsman, cause why not? And I'm gonna spawn a swordsman, why not? Okay, so he's completely surrounded and he can't really do crap against us. So let's go, buddy. Um, we're just gonna end round, please. Now, I can't use the javelin, which is the only thing. Or, two of my javelin I can't use, but, I mean, I can always move them. So, anyways, we're gonna kill you. So, yeah, this, this, this is going so much better <laughs> than previous fights. Just throwing that out there. Um, you can move and shoot. And then we're gonna do this and this. And you're dead. And basically, all we took was just a tiny bit of damage on you. Well, about half damage on one of our horsemen and then you. And I don't know where the rest of his units, because I thought he had four at one point. So, totally okay with this. All right, war support's going up. We're pulling this back, man. I gotta wrap this episode up. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like, comment, let me know what you think. As always, hit the subscribe button, join the game, come share your support. See you guys later. Bye, everyone.